welcome back to Old Plastic. Today I have a mail call. I have a package that I just received and we're going to open it up and take a look at it. This one is a pretty special figure that I recently purchased out of a Facebook group. Now uh, you might be able to see some Luke Skywalkers to the left and to the right of the camera and those are my cater Luke Skywalkers that I'm still sorting through to finish my reorgani reorganization videos and uh, I know it's been a week and it should have been done already but uh, that'll probably be sometime this weekend but for today we're going to take a look at this special delivery I'm going to pause the camera and cut the tape on this box and show you guys what's inside all right guys i got the tape cut on the end of the box now people often talk about their grail items or you know their their grail pieces um well this is truly for a luke skywalker farm boy collector uh this is definitely definitely would have to be classified as a grail item for my collection. Um, <clears throat> I never thought I would own one. It's extremely rare and very difficult to find in nice condition. And if you ever found one in nice condition for sale, it would be uh, probably out of my price range. But um, the stars aligned and I was able to find one that I could actually afford. Um, I had to shift some funds around to make this deal happen, but uh, yeah, <clears throat> I am completely floored that my 2021 is turning out like this. Um, you might have seen my last unboxing video where I uh, unboxed the first figure that I received this year was a second orange-haired Luke Skywalker, which is a grail in, it, in and of itself. Um, so yeah, let's uh, dig into this box. Very well packed. Oh, it's extremely heavy. This was really, really well packed. I have to thank the seller for that. Um, it's a, a fragile figure. Um, it's uh, I, uh, so excited here. <clears throat> It's very, very heavy. I'm very surprised how heavy this feels in my hand. It feels like a gold brick. Whew, I never thought I'd hold this in my hand. I can't believe how heavy it is. You guys figured out what it is yet? Oh my goodness. Almost there. Oh. Look at that. Yes, that is a model trim Luke Skywalker. I'm gonna pause the video and see if I can't get him to stand on the doll stand. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here he is. This is an authentic Brazilian model trim Luke Skywalker farm boy. He is in uh, 
fairly rough condition. He has a lot of paint uh, chips and um, the saber has been broken off. Now, when I told you he was extremely heavy when I was holding him, it's because he's made out of lead. And the lightsaber, I believe, was copper wire and it appears to be broken off. And um, yeah, I, I just never in a million years thought I would own a model trim of any sort, uh, let alone my focus of Luke Skywalker. Um, I, I'm just, uh, <laughs> I'm in shock right now. I, I don't believe it really. But, um, you know, I would have, uh, you know, as a focus collector, it's all about getting that first one, you know, to have that placeholder. And someday uh, I might have a really nice example of a model trim, but I am just blown away that I'm able to have this example in my collection and I can still see his beauty. Well, let you guys take a closer look. He is a little bit tattered. So yeah, he's uh, definitely been played with, and uh, he's been well loved in his life. But I can still see that uh, beautiful figure that I fell in love with in 1977. And I'm just ecstatic to have a real, authentic, model trim Luke Skywalker in my collection. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just so thrilled. Thank you all very much for watching. Uh, subscribing, liking, and supporting the channel, I appreciate it. And uh, I have some uh, other Grail items coming in the mail shortly, so stay tuned. Thank you very much. Bye.